Hi, my name is Dusty Campbell. I'm a product specialist with Yogel Corporation of America. Today, we're going to learn how to change out an amp on a DY digital vortex flow, flow meter. Um, obviously, you've done some testing here, and you, you realize that your amp is bad, either by lightning strike, power surge, or something. Um, so we're going to go run you through the paces on learn how to do this. Um, if Be sure, one, you're going to get the correct amp, be it brain or heart or foundation field bus. Um, if you are changing from brain to heart or to foundation field bus, you want to make sure that you get with your service um, contact within uh, YCA and order a digital um, U-Flow data plate that will describe the change. So you're going to go from, say, this one will go from brain to heart. We want to make sure that we record this so that you have the integrity of explosion proof um, application. First thing we're going to do is loosen the cover. Remove it. You want to pull your display off. Don't worry about losing your screws because these have screw keepers on the board behind it. So we can just unscrew these, unscrew these all the way. And be careful when removing it so we don't bend the pins. Put that to the side. Now we want to loosen up your hardware that's holding the amp in place. And it'll come out with your fingers. Once they're loose, again, be gentle when pulling so we don't damage the pins. Removing the old amp. Right, when you're putting your new amp in, you're going to be getting on, on these pins and these pins here. So make sure, be sure you're orient, orientated correctly. Line your line up pins into the holes. And this may take a time or two, so be gentle with it. Make sure you get your pins all the way in. Okay, now that we're set on the pins, we'll just go ahead and ease these in, finger tight. And then tighten just a little, little bit more to ensure that it's going to stay. Be careful not to over tighten them. Same thing with your display here. You're going to be mounting on this set of pins. So make sure your orientation is correct. Line your screws up for your holes and your pins. And again, be gentle here. And this may take a, a stab or two to get it correct. Place your cover. Be careful not to cross thread this. So be gentle on the start. Get down hand tight and just a bit more to seal it up. And that's how we change an amp.